belong like uh, important people on this planet because um, you carry all four elements okay um, I carry two elements and the people who are cups people carry two elements but the people who were born from November 29 until December 17 you carry all four elements you are different you have always felt the difference since the day you were born on this planet welcome this is going to be a year of extraordinary this is going to be a year that you're going to be finding out who you truly are and what you're here for and um, what I'm advised to say to you guys is that not only listen to your sign because what is going to happen is that you have to do a new birth chart because um, you have been vibrating with the energy of the Sagittarians and it is good so um, I from um, another three months I will be doing birth charts so you can um, um, order a birth chart reading um, on my channel okay um, donate as you will um, uh, there's a donate button um, try and see if you can um, buy the book my book because that is going to help you also because there's information in that book where um, when you guys read the book you're going to be understanding certain other things okay okay ladies and gentlemen your month is going to be wonderful because so the energy of the wheel of fortune and the zodiac energy of the hair and the water air and water in this month so this is going to be good um the chariot is here to help you guys to move forward to understand who you are uh, the chariot and the wheel of fortune so that means that most of you spirit guides and that sort of a thing will be coming in uh, to open up your awareness the consciousness movement is going to be happening with you guys so month of February let's see what is happening we have four weeks in the month of February please remember to listen to your Sun moon and rising sign and the general read and it's very important and please every week listen to this tale of the reading the week uh, that we're in and then um, go back and listen to the weekly readings because there's a lot of information that you will receive out of the readings okay so let's move in and because you have the energy of the Empress and the energy of the Empress is a positive wonderful energy energy of the Empress is a good energy what is happening here is that whatever your situation is so be careful in this month because you can get pregnant in this month be careful um, your materialistic needs your um, the, the female intuition is going to be extremely high in this month okay for you um, guys your female intuition is going to be like so high focus a light beam you're going to be feeling it you're going to be seeing things you're going to be knowing things before they happen that sort of a thing so be aware of this okay I'm just looking at my telephone and <laughs> um, the first week let's look at the first week um, we have four weeks in for the general energy the energy in the first week it is the energy of the tower and you guys have the energy of you standing up for yourself and this is good so the energy of the tower when the energy of the tower comes in it is things and situation and people are being removed away from you and what is happening is that the energy of this is coming in because the energy of the tower is removing things that no longer serve you and you are standing up for yourself and letting people know this is where how far you go and uh, don't go over this line okay it's as if you are protecting yourself this is you um, you know standing up for yourself and yet still um, in a good way but saying this is where it's it goes and no further and this is um, a very very positive because sometimes we need to tell uh, show people and tell people look do not um, step over my boundaries okay because sometimes um, people tend to do that in the second week the energy of the star and it brings you the ten of Pentacles so this is wonderful for you absolutely people this is wonderful so in the second week you are going to have um, the energy of the ten of Pentacles coming in for you guys which is good um, it can be far family in inheritance it can be out um, a pain out of something which is can be insurance payout it can be 
um, extra money coming in you know these things can happen in different form and different situations so it depends on what it is but this can be also family helping you out of a situation which is going to be extremely good and very good okay so the energy of the star brings you the ten of Pentacles so that can um, also be if you have your own business um, the second week of February is going to be a very 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 successful time because you are going to be feeling the energies and having um, the money and situation to um, to um, deal with whatever come your way okay let's look at the third week the third week is the energy of the moon and you guys have the energy of the four of swords and this is good because it, it's a wonderful energy four of swords is just saying that it's time you take some rest the four of swords is always um, saying it's time you take some rest whatever is going on it is um, time you take rest because as you rest in this time and this period you are going to be energizing yourself for um, the rest of the month and what is coming up and this is um, very good because when um, the energy of the moon and the four of swords come together if that is when your guides and angel talk to you and give you information and if you're a creative person um, the third week is going to be extremely good for you because information will be coming in and especially the people who are healers because you all can choose to vibrate on different energy vibration and the people who are healers it's as if your chakra system is going to be aligned it's as if your DNA straw is going to be aligned and awaken in the third week okay so we're calling up um, on the angels and guides to show us what's happening in the fourth week because the fourth week is the energy of the Sun and you guys have the energy of the seven of swords in reverse so this is so good because what is happening is that whatever is there was a theft whatever the theft was um, whoever has done this the energy of the Sun comes up and with the energy of the Sun the theft is as if it comes to light um, it's as if someone stole something and this theft came to light someone stole something and the energy of the Sun bring it to light and people are being um, uh, people are being um, as, as if um, now people are going to be paying for certain things that was done it's as if there was something that people were doing on the need to um, underneath the the thing there and it's a, as if a theft came out it's as if you work in a huge um, organization and um, corporation there was people who was doing things that was not it's as if they had their own little thing going on without the corporation or the organization knows about it and something happened and a light came everything came to light people were investigated and everything came to light and the truth came out wow okay so that is the energy of the fourth week so whatever that was stolen is going to be returned to you whatever that was stolen is going to be returned to you so okay let's go on and look at the energy of what is happening between the first week you standing up for yourself and the second week with the ten of Pentacles I am not sure what is going on but the Sagittarians also got this energy um you stood up against something and the person that was involved in this is the queen or king of cups so what has transpired and what as what they're showing me is that it is a situation that you stood up for yourself something injustice happened and you stood up for yourself money is going to be paid to you in the second week and it has to do with someone who is either a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion over the age of 40 because this person whoever they are 
did something it's as if they have been blocking your financial flow or they have done something that you could not move forward in your life and now because you stood up for yourself this situation whatever has transpired is going to bring you money okay it's going to bring you money because it's as if people start seeing what had really transpired it's as if people had really start seeing what has transpired and you stood up for yourself and now they have to pay for you it's as if the light the truth came out is a and, and this is good because whoever this person is we're going to look at what is going to transpire with this person going on in the end in, in, in the month so let's look and see what is happening for the second week to the third week what is happening the second week it's an organization so something someone in an organization this woman works in an organization they have to pay you and then you're going to have rest it's as if you need to rest in the third week okay because um, there is a situation that's uh, that's transpired you stood up for yourself against this woman in an organization and there the money is going to be paid this woman has done some this whether it's a woman or a man it's a Pisces a cancer or a Scorpio and what has ever has transpired you have stand up against this woman and they have to pay you some money for some injustice and damage that was done to you okay as we move forward of oh, as we move forward with the ten of Pentacles and you rest in it's as if you have been um, working double time to get the situation resolved whatever that has transpired and here and the ten of Pentacles is you know an organization is a pain you you know because somehow um, an organization or uh, many organization many connections see that there was something that was injustice that has happened and they have to pay you and then um, this organization is going to resolve the situation and it's time for you to rest now because you have gone through it was as if the mole it was as if a tornado it's as if you have been going in a tornado and this has been going for a very long time and now finally um, the truth came out okay now let's move forward and look and see what is happening between the, the third week and the fourth week you have the hermit this is good the hermit with a situation organization whenever these two cards come up together the uh, the elephant and the hermit it is bringing light finally people are working um, in a healthy way in an organization in institutes in organization because people are seeing the truth about the situation something that has transpired apparently whoever this person was was lying about stuff trying to manipulate stuff and the organization have seen her and the truth came out because the last week you had the seven of swords and the seven of swords is that the Sun the last week is the energy of the Sun and the energy of the Sun bring light to a situation a theft that has had taken place a theft in an organization that has taken place and that in the four bring for it we bring light because the energy of the hermit comes in and shedding a light and showing you what an organization have done okay so mm, 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 mm. okay as we look and see um, the mother of cups could be your mom but um, I'm getting that it's not your mom but it could be your mom for some people if your mom is a is a Pisces cancer or scorpion it could be your mom um, and you you know there's a situation and uh, it could be um, an organization really 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 um, realize what somebody did that was injustice and unfair and this person has to pay you and this organization is looking at the situation whatever as transfer because there was a tip that would happen okay so 
you have the four of pentacles and this is a good energy to have because the four of pentacles it's not that you are holding on on things it's that you are trying to protect what you have okay this energy is that you receive the money you receive money and this for some people is an air finesse if you receive an air finesse hold on onto it because your parents or whoever left you this money has worked very hard and if they choose to give you this hold on to it and do not release it don't sell it don't make sure you you hold on to it put it in the bank don't even use it just let it grow let the interest grow and you keep on working there some people don't win the lottery because they said oh if I win the lottery tomorrow I'll just sit and don't do anything and I'll do this and I do that no I win the lottery nobody will know I will make sure that my family um, receive uh, you know help out my family and I'm continuing to work why would you want to win the lottery and I mean I've always said if I win the lottery I'm going to um, adopt 10 different kids from 10 different culture that is my thing there analogy of winning the lottery and that's why a lot of people do not understand why they don't win the lottery because why they want to win the lottery is not the right thing and don't change your mind and said oh yeah you know that is true no because you still thinking I win the lottery and I stop working oh no I win the lottery I will be working till my debt okay nobody will know and I will make sure that I help organization and people to you know to balance out themselves and that sort of a thing so don't no matter what happened just hold on to what you have because whoever left you this air finesse or this extra money that is coming in um, just hold on to it because you're going to need it in the future okay so let's move forward and look and see exactly what is happening um, with the organization and a light being shed on a situation let's see what is happening to the organization and a light being shed on a situation again again ladies and gentlemen this came up for the Sagittarians go and listen to the Sagittarians reading because this energy also came up for the Sagittarians and I'm not placing a card at anything this energy comes up for the Sagittarians the son of Pentacles the son of Pentacles is someone between the ages of 18 and 20 18 and, and 40 this is the energy of someone between the ages of 18 and 40 and what has transpired is that uh, this person who works in an organization or this person um, realize a theft that went on and this person is going to um, balance out the situation okay because this person and this is this person um, can be 18 years old or so and this person is someone that is going to be in your life and um, you are going to share your financial abundance with this person because this person helped you out and whatever you receive you're going to be holding on to it but yet still sharing it with this person share it with this person it can be your child and um, and if your child is if your child is um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and 18 and between 18 and 40 this could be something that is affecting him because what is happening is that this child could find out something that happened and is um, alerting you of um, of what has transpired okay and um, this man have found out something and alerting you as to what has transpired okay uh, this person is much younger than you are and it is a situation that um, you are going to realize a theft that has a transpire and a theft that happened to you okay so let's move on and let's see what is happening here the truth the light you're finding your inner strength this is and and, 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 and uh, this is this is so powerful because this month uh, wow these two coming up together because this is the outcome this is the outcome the angman in reverse so 
you a whole lot of things is going to come to light in the month of February a whole lot of things because you yourself if it's on a personal level you yourself is going to find out that oh my god I didn't know I can actually do this it's as if a lot of people are going to find out that there are things that they can do that they weren't aware of a lot of people are going to see through the illusions that other people make for them or a lot of people are going to see through a lot of illusions that they weren't seen before so it's a month that is clear cut that is showing you and for others this is a situation that you find out a lot of stuff it was as if people were hiding stuff from you it's as if um, a whole lot of information is going to come to you because you're going to be finding out a whole lot of information because things are going to be coming out about the Pisces and the Kansas and the Scorpion they have to pay you some money something that they do came out to life and an organization is going to be looking at that person and at and, and the light the truth is going to come out about that person okay so that is going to be um, something else and um, and then the theft the theft that um, take place is going to come out in the last week the last week a lot of stuff so um, uh, the overall energy for um, the month for you guys is the angman in reverse which is so wonderful and so powerful and if you look at your reading there are only um, one major or two major arcana that came in and the major arcana that came in is the energy of the hermit and the energy of the hangman in reverse and these are good these are secrets being revealed these are information coming out these are secrets being revealed and information coming out so um and and the um focus the middle what is going to happen to you guys is a situation with an organization or institutes and whatever that transpire because it's as if um money is going to someone hold on or held on to money in an organization or institutes and then you have the energy of the four of swords um, you're you know you're taking a break to this and then you have the energy of the four of Pentacles with the son of Pentacles four of Pentacles with the son of Pentacles and this this energy with the son of Pentacles is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person but there is somewhere that you're balancing out some financial situation but the truth is coming out and here you are have the two of swords so there is going to be a lot of stuff that is coming out it's as if um, it is going to be um, um, clarity it's like clarity is going to come up and you have the energy of the M M uh, um, Empress so a whole lot of clarity a whole lot of stuff is going to come in and the truth is going to come out in the month of February so this is going to be wonderful <laughs> take a sip of my coffee before it's cold so here we are we're going forward and then looking at what I oh isn't this beautiful you have the energy of Archangel Michael and um, a lot of people are seeing orbs around me the last time for the people who are in the fourth dimension and fifth dimension and I'm seeing one it's as if it's always there protecting me and um, Archangel Michael comes up for you guys so what is happening um, for you um, obsolete man is that Archangel Michael is going to protect you in this month while all these information comes out that you need to know but it's he's going to protect you because these information are coming out but he is going to protect you well, this is an orb what you can do is just focus on this orb just closely focus on this orb and what it's going to do it's 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 going to put a, a protective shield over you and this is going to be um, protective so you know you can always come back to the site and 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 and, and look and see what um, you can receive because it's as if uh, it's lightening up when it's on the light it's as if 
the ores is yeah there it is it's as if it's it's light the light is getting um, brighter and brighter and that's why they are orbs okay um, I can see um, purple which is Archangel Zadkiel and Saint Germain also um, that they they carry the purple flame and uh, um, the pure light is always Archangel Gabriel and the blue is uh, Archangel Michael okay you need to learn um, the um, the energy and the race of uh, a certain race and energies that you can use Archangel Michael Ray is blue okay let's see what the ascendance masters have for you guys and it says the Uma prior so if you need to help to manifest stuff this is a um, the Uma prior is very good to do so all you have to do is write down what you need and use the Uma prior to manifest that which you need okay and I am going to read it. It says the Ayas, the Ayas priest Hermes, which is the Hermit, okay, took its tribe from Atlantis to um, Hawaii, where he established the Kahuna tribe and thought the tri the tribe the ha the Huna priors. First, you need to address your priors to an angel or a master. Okay, we have angels and we have masters of your choice. So let's see. You want to abund um, um, financial abundance, so you're going to call upon Archangel Annual because she's already in the month, in the third week. And you want to heal your financial flow. You're going to call up an Archangel Raphael, the green, the green way. It also um, um, heals you, but it also heals things around you. And you're going to say this for um, 30 days nonstop. So whatever you uh, call upon and ask for, you're going to say 30 days nonstop. And you're going to see that this is going to manifest. Okay, this is a good one. As we move forward, your readings are getting out so long. <laughs> empowerment. Isn't this a reading of empowerment? Yes, it is. Thanks to all my angels and guides because they have been, you know, bringing out the right energy. This is a month of empowerment, ladies and gentlemen. This is a month of empowerment. You're going to empower yourself. The frequency of empowerment supports our abilities to show up fully and completely, uniting us with others in the deepest trust that we all are connected through the same source empowerment you all are going to be empowered look at the sign and focus on it and connect with it because you are going to feel empowered at the end of February I love these energies you have the energy of the Una prior and it says watch out for the signs from the universe and take necessary action I always started and I never ended I am so so busy, um, you know. But I'm, 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 yeah. So anyway, ladies and gentlemen, the Uma prior and empowerment is going to be a month of empowerment, and this is going to be good. Your color for the month is going to be blue. It's going to be all blue, ladies and gentlemen. Your color for the month is going to be blue. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. I want to say namaste until next month and I'm wishing you a wonderful wonderful um, month um, um, don't forget to like shares and thumbs up namaste